Hey, Joe, I really like the way you've customized your workbench here. Things really seem real handy here. Thanks, Danny. Yeah, I know how much you like organized tools, so mm -hmm. I just took this, this is just a one by four shelf that I drilled some holes in just to drop my screwdrivers in. And I put the taller ones in the back and the shorter ones in the front just so you can see them more easily. Mm -hmm. And I took that same basic idea of drilling holes in shelves for other storage ideas. Okay. Here I just drilled a hole in the corner of the shelf because I noticed working at the bench, you never seem to have light right where you need it. Right. So I had this old desk lamp and I drilled a hole in there and ordinarily it comes with a clamp that's supposed to hold this in place. Yeah, but those always get lost and they never really work that well. Never. They can never hold the lamp. So here you just drill a hole in the shelf. Great. And that holds it right where you need it. And then you really move this around anywhere you need to as far as focusing it on any work you're doing. So that's perfect. Great idea. Then, again, that same idea of drilling a hole in the shelf I use to help with glue storage. Okay. You know, when you're using glue and you only have half a bottle, especially yeah. when it's cool out and the glue's not flowing very smoothly, you know, you have to shake it or wait a while for the glue to come down to the tip. And here at the workbench, you use a lot of glue like that. This is the yeah. perfect place to keep it. Uh -huh. So, again, the solution is to drill a hole in the shelf. Here I have a... 7 16th inch bit, and we're going to drill it back an inch or so from the front of the shelf. You can do it right up from the bottom. Kind of splinters up the shelf a little bit, but that's all right. And then you just store the glue upside down.